is Tim Ports here back with another video. In this video, I'm going to show you guys how to make a logo concept. So this is actually really, really simple. Um, some people actually don't know how to make it, so this is why I'm obviously making this, tut tut this tutorial. Um, so yeah, hopefully you do it in this video. Uh, let's get straight into the tutorial. So first of all, you will need this rectangle tool here. Uh, put your fill to nothing, so this line here. And then you'll put your stroke to about yeah white, and you're gonna put. Uh, we'll just change that after we've done it, so it's like a proper. Um, yeah, just like a view of it. So what we're gonna do here is I'm gonna make a T, or yeah, a T for tempo. So what you're gonna do is just make like make it look like a T, obviously. So I'm gonna go like that, and then I'm gonna change this as I said I would. So pull it to a place where you like. I like it around six. Um, six. Yeah, six. Looks good. Right click, rasterize the layer. And as you can see, you've got this here. So I'm just going to center that by pressing this one and then that one. Right, so now we've got a rectangle here. I'm going to call this a line. So I don't like get muddled up. And then I'm going to control J it. As I did say, this tutorial was like simplest tutorial ever. So yeah, I'm just going to flip that around like that. Put it on the top. You can put it like bendy or anything like that. Just so make sure it's like straight a little bit Let's see yeah we'll just do a bend a little bit like that now you need your pen tool and you're just gonna um, make sure you actually group these together so you can press control and then click on that one and then press control or command E and it's gonna like cut across basically like that yeah make it a bit more make it better right so I'm gonna click here and then there I'm gonna drag the slightest bit ever like that and then it's gonna uh, group that together. So yeah, after you after you press OK, you want to control C and then you want to press delete and control V. Uh, it should be like this and then you're just going to like put it a bit like that, I guess. Yeah, that looks pretty nice. And then you're going to do the thing like here. So you're just going to do this like that. Make selection, control C, delete. Oh yeah, make sure you're obviously on the on that um, copy here. Control C, delete, Control D, Control V. Um, pretty simple. <clears throat> Press V and that'll just make your selection tool. Then you're just gonna do the same what you did to the other one. You can make it look like it's a glitch effect by doing that. Uh, but I'm just gonna do it like keep it simple as this is a simple tutorial and it's simple to do. So just like that looks good. So yeah, hope you enjoyed this video guys, uh, leave a like on this video if we could hit 20 likes on this video, that would be amazing. And if you guys could comment down below some suggestions uh, for a new pack, because I know you guys love the packs. So yeah guys, I'll see you in my next video, you guys are awesome, and yeah, peace. And uh, tell me if my audio sounds better because I did get a pop filter and I got this new um, uh, thing that like does your audio, so yeah. Um, peace out guys.